was that? Hello. Hi. So today I am going clubbing. Now I have gone clubbing I think once this year and twice in the past two years. So I haven't been clubbing in a while. It's not really my thing. But you know what? I've decided I need to find an excuse to get cute because I'm feeling disgusting disgusting i need to figure myself out this camera isn't doing how i look justice but in real life like in the mirror over there that is that's shocking but yeah i'm i'm ready to go have a night out on the town enjoy my life <laughs> let's get into getting ready i need to pop in the shower because i am just oh i feel gross i'm gonna be wearing some clip-in extensions and they were very matted and knotted but i'm gonna i'm gonna do a little hairstyle with them so my lovely boyfriend is gonna finish brushing my fake hair it is good do i look so i'm gonna go shower do my hair and then i'll be back for the fun part the makeup so i'll see you in a second i'm back I bought these in America and these are the last ones that I have so I'm kind of upset. Always snack before going out. That is my biggest lesson to you guys. And let's get into makeup. Okay, so for primer, I'm going to be mixing the Rare Beauty Primer with the Emco Beauty Flawless Glow. This can be used as a foundation, but I'm going to be using it as a primer today mixed with this. And this is a insane dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter. And you know why? I feel like clubbing is the one exception where you can cake it to the max like just cake your makeup i love doing that and now i'm just blending this all in my face with my foundation brush so now for brows i'm going to be doing them really light i don't want to take away from the look i'm going to do like a really black smoky wing eye like really black because the outfit that i'm wearing is very dark and sexy I'm just really extending the tail of my brow. Okay, so I actually got this next product in my drugstore makeup video. If you haven't watched that, make sure to check it out. But this is really good. It's the MP Wonder Brow. And it's kind of like a little lamination. And this really sets my brows down very well. And then it has this like brush on the other side where you can really like push them into your skin and make them sit flat like how a laminated brow would. And then I actually like to get my finger and just pat Pat them onto my face and it just makes them really flat and gorgeous okay it's time to carve out the brows i am using the rare beauty little concealer this is great for under the brows because i basically got the lighter shade that they have okay and now i'm just blending this onto my lids as a base for the eyeshadow i have so many things that i just want to spew out of my mouth because the reason why i started this channel is because i literally love just sitting down and like talking to you guys and like keeping you up with my life and I feel like recently especially this year I'm not gonna lie I haven't been in a good mental state a lot of things have happened in my personal life as some of you guys may know and I just honestly haven't been in the mood to like sit here and do an actual get ready with me and, and tell stories and blah 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 like I just I can't do that because I'm actually mentally very upset but I'm really getting into a better headspace now and things are improving and as you guys may or may not know I am doing a little podcast because you can only delve so deep into stories and it get ready with me you know what I mean so I have so many things that I just want to talk I just to talk with you guys so we're gonna be having a little sleepover party every week and i'm super excited to get into that anyways let's continue and now i'm just also carving above my brows and i'm using the hourglass concealer for this as it's a little bit darker than the rare beauty one all right now that we're done with the brows before we get into anything let's curl my lashes in melbourne it's been getting so dark so so early and it's just really messing up my body clock and making me really upset because I love when days last longer. I don't thrive in the winter. I try to avoid the winter, but it's like five o'clock and like the sun has basically set, which is not ideal for my life. I'm really just gonna go heavy with the dark colors. Also, everything is looking a lot less dark in this lighting because it is so bright. Also, instead of a cut crease, I'm just gonna pack a white shade on my lid. I'm really gonna darken up the outer corner by adding black shadow and just blending that outwards kind of in the shape of a wing like just upwards like i get it it looks really messy now but it won't it'll look good and if it doesn't look good well guess who's 
I'm leaving the house. This next step, I'm scared for. I don't know if it will work, but I'm actually taking a gel liner and I'm gonna try and put this in my waterline because I wanna achieve like a really dark eye. Okay, I'm scared. If I get like pink eye from this, I'll be mad. Okay, I'm gonna try and do my upper lash line. Oh, it work. Oh! Why does that slay a little bit? Okay, let's do this eye. That kind of works. <laughs> Keep you updated with if I'm fine or not. It worked. Oh, oh. I'm gonna do a hectic wing, really long, using the Kai liner. Like I look in the mirror and my eyes look so dark, but in this lighting, they look like I'm doing a natural look. <laughs> All right, I have to go do this eye off camera. All right, and now I'm kind of just blending out the wings with a black eyeshadow. Okay, and I know we're not done with the eyes, but to finish the eyes, I need to finish the face because I'm really gonna try and do something with under my eyes. But let's get started on the skin. I'm just mixing the NARS foundation and the Charlotte Tilbury foundation. Now remember guys, we're going out so we could be as cakey as we please. This is looking yellow. Now this decolletage area. I'm pretty sure it will be covered. So I'm not going to put like tanning product on until the dress is on because what's the point in that? I don't want to tan my whole body. Now just highlighting with Hourglass and with Rare Beauty. Alright, now I am going to contour. I'm not gonna lie. My eyes are getting quite watery, which is a problem because we know where that's from. Oh! Okay, now I'm applying cream blush. Before I set my face, I'm just patting everything in to make sure it's all in place. So I'm taking the Kylie pink powder. I'm just lightly applying that under my eyes. Look at the difference already. I'm kind of just focusing this in my T-zone area where I'm really shiny because the rest of my face, I want that cute glow, but just not in the center of the face. Okay, so it is now time to contour. And now I'm just gonna contour the nasal cavity. Okay, and I know that this this is looking crazy, but before we move on, I'm going to blush. I'm taking a more coral color first. This is gonna look crazy, but once it's all blended out, trust me, just trust me. And then we're taking the beautiful shade Winter Kiss and just packing that on top and kind of blending that upwards into my under eye area. Okay, yeah, that's crazy. Now, here comes the magic. I am reverse contouring, which is really gonna brighten under my eyes and also like really set my T-zone in place and make it very matte like look at the difference already from this side to this side okay so now that i've done that my face is looking a lot better a lot more matte but i'm going to use my trusty dusty veil soft focus setting spray and then on top going in with the rare beauty setting spray and i'm just gonna fan my face this also makes my routine feel a lot more bougie so i'm now gonna be highlighting with this mecca cosmetica highlighter okay so now it's time to finish off the eyes i'm gonna give myself an inner eye cat wing which is a large cat wing today now for a bit of fun i'm gonna add some white liner underneath my cat wing and we're also going to do this line under the wing now that looks crazy but we're going to go back in with the kai liner and just go underneath we're going to take this black like i said i really want dark under eye we're going to take the black and we're going to smoke it out okay so now that i've done this little under eye moment it's time to make the look come together a little bit more seamlessly so i'm just applying a thick coat of mascara okay it is now time for the lips this is gonna bring everything together i still haven't decided whether or not we're gonna do fake lashes let's just do the lips first and then we'll see how everything goes so i'm doing kind of a brownie liner and i want to tie it in with like a super nude lip color to make it like very 90s vibe <laughs> All right, I'm now gonna put this lighter shade in the very middle of my lips. I'm gonna be a little bit controversial and put some concealer. Okay, too much. I'm gonna try and blend this out. I'm gonna go again with the brown lip liner and just really define it. Oh, I feel like this is the look complete, but I wanna just hold off a lash and see how we feel about the lash. Ooh, that is kinda nice. I think we have to do a lash, don't we? It really changes the whole trajectory of the look. Okay, I'm gonna go put the lashes on and then I will be back for the final look. Okay, you guys, I am back. 
and I'm feeling really cute. Let's take out these little clips. This is like the finished look done and I think that the lashes actually really have given me a new sense of confidence. I feel really cute with the lashes. But yeah, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this little get ready with me. I'm kind of excited, kind of nervous. To be honest, I'll probably be out for approximately three seconds of the night and then I will be straight back home in bed with my product, my Adrian. But this is the final look. much for joining me and keeping me company with my little get ready with me i'm super excited i feel super cute that's the main thing thank you guys so much for watching make sure to like subscribe follow me on instagram at leah holton underscore and i will see you all very soon and i love you so 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 much Changes the whole trade. Tra really changes the whole trade. Whoa.